score. Whoa, girl. I did what you asked, Father, but something is different about this one. It's not taking like it should. She may be protected. Uh oh. Yes, we'll just have to wait and see. She's insane. -o. More souls then. What? Yes, they all deserve to bask in the glory of God. Oh, you cray cray. Stage room. Hey, what's that? Nothing. Eat this. Oh. <laughs> yes. Eileen? Hey girl, are you okay? Don't lose your faith. Girl? Eileen? Eileen? Snap out of it! No, God, it's happening again! Just like it did with Grandpa! What did he do to you? Uh, can we taser her? I'm just asking. Hey, we tasered him. We might as well do her as well. I mean... I don't think that will help her. Hey, it was worth it. <laughs> <coughs> what? <laughs> I need to smoke, right? I prefer to smoke outdoors. No, fine. Okay, so that's no help. Um I don't think that will help her. Well, I don't know. Can we can we at least, you know. She's catatonic, breathing but unresponsive, just like grandpa. Hacker? Okay, I'll try. Yes. We will insert this into her brain, reboot her. And then I don't think that will help her. Lockpick her brain? Okay, yes, that's an excellent idea. Chat your, your own point on this, really. I don't think that will help her. No. <laughs> what? That didn't work either? <gasps> I'm shocked. <laughs> okay, let's see. Um, talk? Wake up, E. Untie. Let's get these ropes off of yes, you. Yes, please. Did you say anything else? Ernest Edward Price, born December 20th, 1898, died May 8th, 1973. We're not going to do this with everything, right? Agatha Price, born November 13th. Barbara Price, born July 19th. Arthur Price. Uh. Henrietta Ann Price, Father Bill's wife. William Thomas Price, Father Bill himself. Joshua David Price, Isaac's brother, perhaps? Isaac Jeremiah Price, born March 3rd, 1959. The death date is left blank. That grave is blank, probably reserved for future descendants. That grave is blank. That grave is blank. He's knocked out cold. Good. You won't get away with this. Nuh uh. Search? Oh, yes. He had a key on him. <gasps> yes. You're stunning people again? Maybe. I didn't do her. Okay, I did, but in a, just in a different way. Never mind that. I'm trying to help. Um, oh, I have a rope now? Girl, what am I supposed to do with you? I have no... Hmm. Taze him again to make sure... You guys are more evil than I am, just to make that clear. He's had enough. It could kill him. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that will help her. I don't think so either, but we, you know, we have to try everything. Um... supposed to do with you girl is there nothing else is there something outside I Get should make sure he's not a threat before leaving oh I can oh I can tie him up yes Aha. 
That should do it. I better go get help before he comes to. Go get help? Okay. What about Eileen? All right, we'll oh. take it from here. I see. Should we bring what's her name to the clinic? Eileen. Eileen. And no, she's not physically hurt. It's just shock. That's all. I'll take care of her. Please, just drop us off at Grandma's. All right, then. But don't think you're off the hook for that stunt you pulled at the station. <laughs> Considering the circumstances, I'm going to refrain from hauling your ass back to that cell. Thanks. You better not leave town until we've sorted all this out, or you can look forward to a statewide APB. Got it? That's more than fair, Sheriff. Thanks. Good. Come by the station when you've dropped off your friend. You'll need to take your statement. I will. Is he called Sheriff Eli? It's my fault this has happened to her. No, it's not. You know exactly who's to blame. That vile man behind bars or whoever is pulling his strings. Mm -hmm. Go there, find out what he knows, and get to the bottom of this. Yes, it's sir. too late for Joseph, but maybe she still has a chance. Well, I'm sure as hell not gonna wait here for her to rot away. Good. She'll be safe with me. Hello. All right, then. I'm off. I said hello. <laughs> Thank you, Easy Kelly. Five months already. One more month and you get a new cookie. Yes. <laughs> Thank you for the sub, sweetie. Thank you. And keep enjoying those emotes. Okay, so I didn't really understand uh, what had happened to her grandfather. I, I I got that he was in a wheelchair, but apparently he was catatonic as well. Um, or unresponsive. And I didn't quite get that from the beginning. I had some clues, of course, but I wasn't sure. So if this is what happened to him, and he's been like that for years in a wheelchair... I mean, wow. That's rough. Now I definitely want to know and find out what's going on. Okay, so where... Where should we go exactly? Sheriff's office, we need to talk. Hey, you're back. Mm hmm I am. You guys want my statement? Yeah, the sheriff is waiting for you. All right. Oh, sure. Hey, dude. Let's talk, sheriff. Oh, that's why they were talking about his And stroke. that's when I found that creep with her tied uh. up in the crypt. Jesus. I had my suspicions about that church, but I never thought it went this deep. Yeah. So, what happens now? I'll call the judge and get a warrant. If we find anything else, that bastard won't get away with it. Okay. Can I go talk to him? Please. Go ahead. Ask Lenny to go with you if you need him. Okay. Will do. Thanks, Sheriff. Think nothing of it. Yeah, they never specifically said he was catatonic, I think. Just that he they thought he had a stroke. Uh, and he was out of it. Uh, like he was, I thought it was temporary. That's what I thought. Like he was, he was found that way, but he was, I don't know. I thought it was temporary. I just didn't get that. Anyway. Okay, let's talk to this dude. Let's give him a piece of our minds. I'd love nothing more, but I need to figure out what he knows. Aww. <laughs> Fine, we'll talk to him, I guess. He's where he belongs. <laughs> Hello again, my child. I hope you enjoy that cell as much as I did. For a man of faith, this is a room fit for a king. Speak what you will. I have all the time in the world. 
Okay. Well. Um. I don't know about Arlene first. Tell me what you did to my friend Isaac. Yeah. I offered her to God, and the Lord accepted her with open arms. She is part of his world now. You're not talking about a Christian God. Of course not. I'm talking about the old God, <gasps> slumbering in the darkness beyond. <gasps> what are you saying? You offered Eileen's soul to this God of yours? She is but one of many. I guided them all to the stairs of judgment. <gasps> Wait, so you were responsible for all those people disappearing? Going crazy? All I did was bring them face to face with God. No, bad. If they chose to reject him, they were beyond redemption. Bad. Bad man. Bad. I'll spray you with water and bite your ankles. I will. I will. I will. Did you have something to do with what happened to my grandfather? Alas, I did not. At the time, I wasn't enlightened. And neither was my father. Hmm. But Grandpa showed the same symptoms as Eileen. Then he was claimed by God, without my guidance. Praise him. No, no. There's no praising him. Oh, God. Simon is, is, is already going towards Cthulhu. And it's... It is an old god, though. If this turns out to be Cthulhu. <laughs> I've got to laugh so hard. <laughs> Although I don't, I don't know. Oh, boy. What do you really know about Lily Myers? Oh, the drowned girl is a conundrum. In life, part prophet, part mender. In death, ascended, united with the holy conduit. What? Christian churches really don't like hereditary priesthoods, not for a thousand years or so? I, I, I don't know. <sighs> I'm not, I'm really interested in what this god thing is now. Why did you have Lily Meyer's painting stolen? Because Charles Wade isn't a man keen on sharing. Ugh, fine. Let me put it this way. Why did you try to get your hands on the paintings? Lily was special in God's eyes. A chronicler, a bestower of wisdom. As an emissary of God, it was my duty to unlock the divine knowledge in her work for all of mankind. But where is it? What is your church really about, Isaac? What are you trying to accomplish? The same as any other church. All we want is the salvation of mankind. By any means necessary? Clearly kidnapping isn't out of the question. A necessary evil. I look at the bigger picture, the greater good. One day you'll understand. You are quite obviously brainwashed. I'll stop you, if it's the last thing I do. You can try, child. I have God on my side. The greater good. Also... <clears throat> Who is the man dressed in red? Yes. No one that concerns the likes of you. Wait, so you do know something about him? Tell me. Certainly, but that knowledge is not to be shared with unbelievers. No, no, dude, you need to tell me. I'll tease you again. I will. I will. I don't need to show that to him. I'd love nothing more, but I need to figure out what he knows. Oh, uh, we know what he knows. Just light torture? I don't need to show that to him. I don't know, I'm trying everything. I don't need to show that to him. Ugh. I don't need to show that to him. I could, but I'd rather not tip him off before I know what this key opens. Did I taste the crazy elder god priest while I was eating lunch? Yes. Yes, it did. Yes, it did. And I'm actually very proud of that. I don't need to show that to him. <laughs> what do you see in this photo? The sign of God. The conduit. Conduit of what? Oh, you'll know soon enough. Oh, well, that's not foreshadowing anything. <laughs> I don't think that's the red man in Sigmata. He looks way too happy. He is bold, though, so... Uh, I am suspicious. <laughs> I don't like this guy at all. Uh, he's creepy. You know something about this flower, don't you? Oh. Yes, a link to the divine. They help by preparing the body for unity with God. So, you've drugged people with it? Mm-hmm. Such a crude choice of words. It has been one component of my sacred work, yes. <sighs> Good Lord. 
I don't need to show that to him. No, I don't. Just, just... I don't need to show that to him. Okay, I think we're done. Well then, I think we're good. I'm done here. Good. Now go repent, sinner. Ah! Rude! Repent! I'm not gonna. I am gonna see what's in your closet, though. Yep. The guy has a few screws loose. Just a few, you say. Just a few. <laughs> Okay, now what is in your cabinet? Please, I need to know. <laughs> I need my loot. Okay, let's not discuss the church too much. Because this can go bad <laughs> really, really quickly. <laughs> okay. I sh probably should look at the tag. A small key with a tag attached labeled storage A5. Storage. Maybe there's a self-storage facility in town. Okay. So it it's... looks a lot like the key I found in the attic. Maybe they're somehow related. Hold up. Those are the same? Nah. Or do we need to look at two storages? Hey, these keys are almost identical. <gasps> they must open different storage units in the same facility. <gasps> Score! Okay, so we still can't go in here? Not a bad idea, but it's not a tumbler lock. Fine. Okay, so I guess we don't need to go here. Do I need to call a storage unit thing? That's because your grandma. Unless I have a new thing. I need your phone! Oh yeah, let's see. Okay, there's a place in town. Got the address, I should head over there. Yes! Is there anything else? Anything else I need to do before I go there? Check on Eileen, just real quick. Might as well see if she's just not shouting weird things. Any change? Sadly not, dear. Hmm. Eileen. I'm sorry, E. Look at the red man in the address book. I can. It's it's not really an address book. It's it's a it's a phone book. So I doubt there's the red man, <laughs> but I can try. I can definitely try. Come on, Eileen. Okay. <clears throat> nope, couldn't find it. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. Um. So, but we have the address, so we can just go there. I really want to go. I want to see what's going on. Show me your secrets. In your storage unit. Is it the yellow pages and the white pages? I don't know. It's leaking. It's not good. It's not good in your storage facility thing. Storage A5. This is it. Oh, already? Ooh. Storage A6. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh. Hello. Hello. I said hello. Deimos! Six months, which means a new cookie, which you can't see because you're a first thing badge holder. But yay, thank you. <laughs> thank you so much, and hello. Uh... Uh, I need to look at it. I think look. it's a small key, fairly modern design, no identifying tag, unfortunately. No. Okay. Fine, we'll open this. Hey, Hospital! 
Are you ready? Are you ready, chat? I don't know what we're gonna find. Okay. Never mind. Oh. <laughs> I don't wanna go in there. No. This is just like Sherlock Holmes. No. No. I know what happened then. That's not okay. It's not good. No, no, no. No. <laughs> Where is it? This is not disturbing at all. No. This is all fine. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Awesome. Where is it? Was he trying to uncover something in these paintings? I don't know. I guess he felt compelled to tell the world how hard he was looking for something. Lunatic. <laughs> okay, same things. I don't believe this. They're ruined. He must have used that paint thinner on the paintings. What? Why? That means there's only a single painting left. The one in the cabin. But why? Why? Why would he do that? I wouldn't worry about it, Farwalker. It's a game. <laughs> he must not have wanted anyone to learn the secrets of these paintings. Okay. A bottle of paint thinner. <gasps> Davos! Davos! You need to share pizza and garlic bread and bacon. You need to share. I know, we had a yellow pages too. It's, it's fine. Actually, our yellow pages had white pages as well. This might come in handy. Whoop, yoink. Okay, so is there anything else? No. Okay, let's go then. It's, it's disturbing enough, so. <laughs> Then. How about this one? Doesn't fit. Must be for a different unit. Okay. How about this one? Oh. Aha! Aha! Let's go take a look. Well, this looks like a normal storage unit, finally. Do you want to bid, Chad? You want to bid on it? You have a bidding war? <laughs> Maybe there's secrets. Nothing useful. Just some old newspapers in those. Mm -hmm. So that's where Grandpa's old uniform went. I wondered why I didn't see it in the attic. So that's where Grandpa. Do we? There's nothing there? Do we need to. combine it with something? Or... I don't want to burn that. Yeah, I don't want to burn that either, but hey, you know, I mean, this, this is what we do now. I don't want to zap that. Uh, Deimos? You can work out at home? <laughs> I don't wanna. <laughs> Insert the floppy. Are we gonna hack the jacket now? Okay, chat. <laughs> hack the jacket. That doesn't take a floppy. There. <laughs> what? Huh? It doesn't work? I am surprised. I know, strength training, well, is uh, bottles of water, or buckets of water, you need to be creative, but I know what you mean, a gym is better. It's a good thing I have a gym at home, yay! Yay! Okay, so there's junk, and there's a uniform, but why is that, do, why do we need... <sighs> I have a feeling I need something with this with this uniform. But what? Box 
boxes empty. Oh. You can search the boxes? Go search the boxes. Go search Found a tape in there. Really? There's also something else. Oh, okay. Never, never a custody mind. appeal form. For me? July 15th, 1981. What? I don't believe it. He... He tried to get me back from my mom. Right to the very end. Pull yourself together, Kathy. Hugs. It's okay. It's okay. We'll be fine. We'll help. Right, Chad? We'll help. Stop with the sad music. We could do this. Okay, let's listen to this tape. <laughs> Hugs. <sighs> okay. That combination makes no- No, it's fine. <laughs> if I find banana cookies, oh my god, don't make me- No, oh my goodness, no. <laughs> oh, not the banana cookies. Oh, that was so bad. Oh, that game. This is Joseph Rain. Operation Log, Part 4. August 8th, 1981. The area appears to be circular with... ...along the outer perimeter. I've determined that some kind of endothermic reaction is taking place. So it's important to be observant of changes in temperature. Hmm? Find the source by severing the link. Perhaps I can save them. Jimmy and all the others. Huh? Reoccurring dream. I'm standing in front of a huge black hole in a clearing in the woods. There's a man dressed in red urging me to jump. Uh oh. I'm afraid to, but I take the plunge anyway. For some reason, I don't think I have anything to lose. As I'm falling, I reach for the parachute cord, but to my horror, there's nothing there. To be clear, he's dreaming. That's when I wake up. Oh. Hey, Salira. Okay. Uh, it's a good thing that the uh, banana cookies are a bit obscure, and it's not like chocolate chip or anything, because then we can't have anything else in this channel. That's just... No, no banana cookies. And if you don't know what we're talking about, you might want to watch Bear With Me. Because, yeah. That was a thing. Okay, to the forest, I guess? To the forest we go. I have nothing else to do here, I guess. Unless there's some... Is there anything here? Just some old newspapers in those. Okay. I guess we're gonna go to the forest then. Nothing here. Storage A6. I can't open it without a key. Okay. Bye then. <laughs> yeah, just leave the doors open. That's, that's, that's fine. That's okay. I don't know. I just. Just leave them open, who cares? Um I guess they Oh. Yoohoo. Hello. There's absolutely nothing here. Cool. <laughs> um I guess we're gonna try everything again. Uh, 
Patrick, I think it's the ending you missed then. <laughs>